So that's why you find that people who just guess work their way into business. So for example, you know, like straight from school, ah, I'm a business and all that. They are very, they are less efficient, but they have the advantage that they they gain some level of resilience over like a long period of time. Right. You know, like over. Because it takes them a long time to get things together, to get things working. I'm trying to show that he, he didn't really want. What is that? Yeah. Huh? Oh, is it this that is making that noise? Yeah, it's a bit of a warning. Maybe it started uh, cycling through. Mm. Cycle? I mean, does it erase the thing? Oh, it erased the footage. So, it just looks like it. it's a simple heuristic. You look at the older footage and then you start overwriting that older footage. Oh, okay. Mm. Oh, so that way you don't have to worry about. Um, Yeah, so I'm saying day job, yeah? Yeah, so it makes you a bit soft in terms of uh, like facing heroes out there in, in society and what Yeah. So that's why you find that people who just guess work their way into business. So for example, you know, like straight from school, ah, I'm a business and all that. They are very, they are less efficient. But they have the advantage that they they gain some level of resilience over like a long period of time. Right. You know, like over because it takes them a long time to get things together, to get things working, they develop some amount of uh, resilience. For a lot of us who are used to just an easy life where They pay they enough you can go to Kamani. Yeah. Uh, some abuse, uh, so. But I can imagine if you're doing a business, if things are going badly, you can find a way uh, where you can't even pay salary, or you can't <laughs> pay. You have a number of mouths <laughs> uh, waiting for you, you can't pay. You, know, you have now Kunyumba <laughs> Manje You can't pay yourself, therefore. Mumbai, you have a number of mouths waiting for you. You can't be so you have. Uh, so it's easy to just feel like giving up. Society like ours, it eventually pays off because you have, um, there's a lot of opportunities and yeah, yeah, a lot of space. Yeah, like I know I, I chat my brother a lot. So yeah. I think he's getting to a stage where he's figured out how to maneuver, right? I mean. I guess also, but his business is seasonal, also, right? so he knows when most of the money comes in. Mm. Yeah. You know, the good thing with him is that the, uh, I think the only thing he just needs to introduce is just a business mindset. The things that he was doing are pretty much uh, one and the same yeah. things that he was doing. Even even if he was working for under somebody else, yeah, he would be doing like hundred percent exactly the same uh, right. stuff. Right. Uh, so I guess he has a bit of an attack. It actually says him uh, better for him to to run this thing on his own. Yeah. Nanga, where's uh, Chung? Roger. Uh, uh, Roger. Hmm. Is he still there? Chung? No, he left a long time back. He left there till at some point he went to. Work for a car at the June or something. Like a money, payment kind of uh, money lending kind uh -huh. of uh, thing. Oh. I think it was on MTR, but he's still running that thing. Huh? 
Oh, that thing failed to take off, right? Yeah, I think it, it failed. failed to take off. They, those guys, uh, they do micro insurance kind of thing, right? Is that the same company? No, the micro insurance is those AO guys. Okay. Mm. So he, he was there, I think at some point from there, I think he was with that Millennium something. That project before it closed. I think he was doing projects there. Yeah. Last I checked. Stand up. Ah, uh, that's when I get the next one, yeah? Ah, okay. Anyways. So, last I checked, he was doing projects yeah. with uh, his younger brother. I don't know if you know his younger brother. Yeah, it was with, uh, I know his younger brother was in Networks or something, but I'm forgetting which company. Uh, Technet. Yeah. yeah. That group from Technic, there's a guy who used to interact with him. Dominic. Hey, where is Dominic? Is that guy? Yeah, yeah. He's yeah, still with Technic? No. So, the story is that those two guys, okay, they, were, they were serious work but partners going to client sites and what not. So, those guys decided to split on Technic Which? and establish oh. their own to uh, B2Y. Established the company, they were doing fine, you know. Okay, they were doing fine now, as usual. You know, business the way business is, you know, when you are starting, it's very easy. I don't know, but when <laughs> money starts coming in, it's a different story. <laughs> 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 I feel like, hey, right when he starts spending all the money on bicycles, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> just see, we all different bicycles. I ah, know that one, I did like the car. <laughs> 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 the thing with business is, uh, depending on the type of business, you start tracking in slightly more. Right? Yeah, yeah, especially theirs. I mean, theirs was a very, is a money spinner, you know? Yeah. Theirs mm. was a money spinner, so um, it's very easy to just, you get like, a good project before you know it. Yeah. Uh, a two million quarter has hit your account. Run studies for a bit, you can do work, do work. Yeah. Mm. But, huh? I'm just supposed to stop this character. Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay, it wasn't. Uh, yeah, I know it was too amber, but you had turned mm. amber on the hot coffee. Mm. Uh, so, so they were a bit wild, and then I think some misunderstanding, they decided to split. I think they formed different entities. So Dominic and who? And uh, uh, Brian. Oh, you know you've met him, huh? Yeah, he, he, he tends to want to bring up money quite too. Yeah, I remember Brian too. Yeah, yeah, great guy. So um, he was. Um, I do something illegal here. Hmm? Just wait for this guy to pass. It's getting past to you. So they split and uh, Brian established uh, an entity called Star Labs. Okay, still mm. in networking, focus on networking. So they do everything. By now they're now doing everything. Okay. Yeah, as usual, they started off infrastructure, you know, mostly networking and uh -huh. servers. But now they've matured. They do, they do it because you know Brian is a is a pusher, you know. Okay. Yeah, he's a pusher. You know, Brian is not a lazy guy who uh, who at the, you call him and just say, you know, could a job, so then why, 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 why? Uh -huh. uh, you call him. You'll be on site. He will be on site. Yeah. You call him before he even understands. You actually need, you actually get what you are trying to do and what you are talking about before he can uh, decide to say, ah, no, I am busy or I've turned this one down or anything. He was disappointed, that, right? You know? Oh, okay. He's sorry to cut you short because I just thought about him. He came here a while back. There was no one, huh? The house. The heritage house, that's a heritage site. So you uh, that one big yeah. mm. Oh, you wanted to see. <laughs> so you know. <laughs> <that. laughs> Honk! Nothing. <laughs> and then I think somebody uh, who works in one of these adjacent plots. Mm -hmm. ah, no, I, I was like, 
Tax payers money. Yeah? <laughs> Somebody's paid money, a lot of money actually, to just uh, sit here and uh, decide not to. Uh, 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 best, best, uh, Mm. Uh, I think. 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 Uh, I